visiting with the all-girl Paranormal Society of Colorado Springs. We have two special guests that come to us from the all-girl Paranormal Society of Colorado Springs. They've been investigating the Rocky Mountain Haunt Fest for any spirits, anything that's out of the ordinary at Gould's Gulch and Mind Seizure Haunted House. Lori, I'm gonna to come to you and I'm going to ask you, what brought you to the Rocky Mountain Haunt Fest? Well, actually, we uh, had a booth at Pride Fest this year and uh, one of your actors came up to us and said, hey guys, I got, I got a place for you. And we hadn't heard it. We didn't know anything about it. And she said, I'm working in this building and it, it's phenomenal. We hear bangs and we see things and things move. And so like, yeah, yeah, we hear that all the time. Yeah, right. okay. You Bump know, of the so, night, right? Yeah, exactly. We heard, yeah, everybody's house is haunted these days, you know. Yeah. So we took the information down or whatever. We ended up coming in and uh, they said, yeah, you know, other people told us, yes, you know, all these actors came flying, you know, the women's bathroom's scary, don't go in there, don't do that. Well, of course, that's a calling card for us. You know, we hear that kind of stuff. Instead of like, running yeah, away, you me, go you know? too, yeah. So we got the team together or whatever and planned it and said, okay, guys, let's come in here. Yeah, it's an old building. We're going to get bangs. We're going to get this. But we never imagined the things that we actually caught. And it was one of our best. And the second time we came back, it was even better. So this place is truly haunted, and we certified it, we know it, and it's one of the best places we've ever been. When we use the word certified, we use it in its true form because we have been here now for two investigations. A pre-investigation that yield, even pre-investigation was phenomenal. Now, there are people out there that, once again, skeptics, people that just don't believe, don't want to, you yeah, know, even look at the evidence out there. But really, when it comes down to all, I bet there's a, statistics that show that X amount of people have had a paranormal experience on their own. Most have. I am staking everything that I am about, you know, as well as Lori, everything that we are about on that we know that what the evidence we have here is real. Yeah. It is the most compelling that we ever have in all the investigations we have done. Yeah, I invite you to look it. at our evidence and we will prove otherwise, you know, but I invite them as well. Come with us. Let us show mm -hmm. you the points around. Oh, we have, encourage it. We encourage much. it. That have been very valid, so I'm not saying that they are, you know, oh, just because you don't believe doesn't mean you don't know. That's not true at all. Um, but we do know what we know. Yeah. And we know what we do is real and that is valid. Um, like Lori, I've been doing this most of my life. It's just something I've done, you know, my whole life. And it's, I just kept doing it. We uh, met, we got together, and found out that we both, you know, we did the same thing, mm -hmm. and pretty much off we went. I mean, here we started, you know, and it's it seems to be the thing nowadays. It seems yeah. to be the thing. Everybody wants to get a camera and a recorder. <laughs> nice they want to they wanna go out and hunt some ghosts and get <laughs> some demons. It's not that way at all. This what? is real. This is real for us. This is what we do 24-7. And it's frustrating to me because people make light of it. Ooh, aren't you scared? Ooh, are there demons? These are real people. They are just like us. They are just dead. Most factual based word I could think of to say absolutely, absolutely, place is haunted. And you have had a paranormal experience here. Oh, we've had oh, many, many, many. Yeah, we've had many paranormal. We're experiences. going to be here at the Rocky Mountain Haunt Fest. The whole team will be here, we'll be and we'll here. answer any question that they have. So, know? so people out there that feel that they have this, this something that they know is there, but have never taken it to another level, can come to the Rocky Mountain Haunt Fest mm -hmm. and possibly have their own paranormal experience okay. here. Absolutely. Yeah, really work it out where we can take people to certain spots where we have seen things, see if they can feel something, see if they can hear something, mm -hmm. because I guarantee. You put 10 people go through this haunt, eight of them are gonna hear a bump, 
feel a touch, hear a whisper. Yeah. That it is, is not, a haunted house. That yeah. is not an actor. And you'll be able to sit down with Lori. You'll be able to sit down with Jordan. They'll tell you their experiences here at the Rocky Mountain Haunt Fest. We're gonna have a TV set up that you'll be able to actually see the footage that they have uh, done in the two investigations that they've done to date. So we invite you to come. The details will be at ColoradoHauntFest.com. We're gonna be here at the Rocky Mountain Haunt Fest through Saturday, November the 2nd. You have your opportunity to come and see two great haunted houses, Ghoul's Gulch and Mind Seizure Haunted House. Once again, all the information you'll find on our Facebook. We invite you to come and like us and possibly win tickets. And you'll find that at Rocky Mountain Haunt Fest on Facebook or log on to ColoradoHauntFest.com for all the details, dates, discounts, all the information you need. Please join us for your paranormal experience. Rocky Mountain Haunted Fest, Mind Seizure, and Ghoul's Gulch Haunted Houses. Open now through Halloween. Southern Colorado's scariest and largest indoor haunts. Five dollar off coupons at all Wendy's and additional discounts at these locations.